my son be a thug, nigga? Do I tell my baby girl that I'm a drug dealer? I'm only counting who I see fuck who was with us. Me and my bitch wanna be faithful, but we love bitches. Hey, can't understand it, so I can't explain. They love me all over the planet, though I can't complain. Hey, shit changed, man, it ain't the same. You probably could take my name for you take my chain. But if I ever get my shit snatched, I bet not catch you on the gram getting my shit back. Like, why you gotta tell the whole world you did that? Man, that's the type of shit that make me think you did that. And that's the type of shit that get a nigga kid snatched. The type of shit that make them boys pop up where you live. What up, YouTube? This your boy, Mile High Chosen One. And we are back here with another video for the day. And in this video, we're gonna talk about the run commit glitch. Now, there is a glitch going around in Madden all about run committing. Now, what is the run commit glitch? The run commit glitch is... If you're rushing only three linemen or three blitzers or whatever, you can run commit every single play and you're going to be safe. The game is going to do the rest for you. So if, you're, if the team runs the ball, of course, your defense is going to run commit. But if you run commit and they pass the ball, they won't run commit, right? So that means you're always safe. So you might be having trouble stopping a run. Guess what? Get into this and run commit every play and set up your, your great pass and defense. I run this every single play on defense. So what we're going to do is, we're going to go into a 3-4 for an example. And we're going to go into a cover four. And then we're going to go against random offenses. The reason why we want to go against random offenses is because I'm about to show you exactly what I'm talking about. So right now, as you guys can see, I'm about to run commit. I just ran commit and just watched my controller. We ran commit, and guess what? The defense didn't run commit because it's a glitch in the game. Now, again, you want to set up good pass defense out of this when you run commit. So we're going to do it again. I'm going to hit it. I'm going to run commit again, and let's see what happens. I'm not touching anything. As you guys can see, they're running. They ran the ball, so we ran commit. Very, very simple, man. This is very good. We're going to do it a couple more times. Run commit. I'm going to show you my hands that I'm not doing anything. They ran They ran the ball, so the team run commits. We're going to do it one more time so they can pass the ball. Um, this is very, very glitchy. This is very tough to defend, man, because you just don't know as we get ran commit. You know what I'm saying? It was a draw, so it went for a pass. Um, but it was still great defense, man. It was very, very good here. One more time. See what they do. Um, again, they ran commit. Very, very good, man. Now, what you have to do is, so once you figure this out, once you figure this part out of, of the defense, now you might be the one who always like to be a nickel or stuff like that. So if you do that, so let's go to a nickel that has 4D linemen rushers, and then we're going to go to random um, offense again. Now, this is what you need to know. If you're coming out on this, you must put one of these guys in a spy or a hook. Why? Because we only can have three people rushing. Now, you need to run commit first because if you don't, do you see how I put him in a hook curl? Now, watch when I run commit and you look up, he's back in a blitz angle. So sometimes if you're not getting used to this defense while you're rushing four players, you're going to forget that you must run commit first because if you don't, Watch this. I'm about to put all these guys in hooks. As soon as you run commit, it's going to make all these guys blitz again. So bl run commit first. Once you run commit, then set up your defense. So um, I'm going to show you. I'm about to run commit now and watch what happens if I run commit now. If it's a run, they're going to still run commit. You see what I'm saying? They be, the reason why they ran commit on the pass is because we rush four. You only can rush three. Now, that, that also includes, you might do this because we're so used to doing this now. You might put him in you might put him in a hook or a spy, and then we might blitz our user. If you blitz your user and run commit, they're gonna run commit every time because the game is reading four rushers. So you can't do that, man. So just just stay back. You know what I'm saying? Go out there and we rushing three. I'm about to run commit, but I gotta change him back because I know what I just did. So I gotta put him on there and watch what happened. If it's a run, they're gonna run commit. If it's a pass, they're gonna drop back. We don't know what they're doing. Um, but it's very tough. They ran commit because it's a run. Again, if you don't believe in it, get into it and, and work it out. Um, this play is, I mean, this form of mad right now is very, very good. If you're struggling to stop the run on offense, just do the run commit defense. If you're not comfortable with coming out with 4D linemen and making them adjustments, just come out in a, anything that has three defensive linemen, you will be all right, man. So I just wanted to give you that uh, run commit defense, man. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'm going to catch you boys on the next one. I'm out.